Hi, my name is Jesper. I will uh, show you how to use uh, the uh, Needs external bus in our new software. In uh, this example, I will show you how to use uh, the level control. We have uh, three different uh, NEB uh, units. Uh, we have a keyboard with uh, eight buttons. We have a port expansion with two IOs, one RS232 and one RS484 port. Uh, and then we have a, a real-time clock. Uh, the third one is a level control, which I will uh, explain you how to use here. We simply drag uh, the item from uh, the list onto the NEB port, and we add it here. It will automatically get the address A, uh, but we can attach uh, one more, and it will uh, get ad uh, address B. Um, then we can attach uh, an amplifier. We have here uh, one supporting uh, multiple in decrement devices. We drag it onto our uh, Sierra in this case um, and we go to assign buttons as we normally would do. We can add an on button to this just for an explanation off to this and here we have the uh, NEB level control where we have three uh, positions where you can drop um, what, what to happen when you turn the nut left and uh, turn it right. Then we have the press in the middle, uh, which is actually a, a normal button. So let's take the volume and drag onto the left turn. Then it will uh, automatically be, be added to the right turn as well. We take the mute and drop onto the press. So let's take the uh, in decrement uh, sequence where uh, we have added to, to the left turn. Uh, to the right we have some different um, settings to do. We have made a shortcut for uh, in decrease uh, the value. Uh, we have some uh, settings for, for compensation to, uh, to use a reverse logarithmic function. Um, then we have three different LED behaviors. Uh, we can see how uh, on these figures how it will react when we select one of them. Uh, we just select level, but uh, we have th some different settings here. So when we upload this uh, project to our Sierra, we will uh, get a uh, what's called a Sierra and a, a level control like this. We select the on button here. And then we will see our level control where we can turn the knot and we will see that our LEDs are changing. And when we get to the maximum level, then it will turn orange and then red. If we select the mute button, then it will change the LED state um, and uh, on again. And that's uh, basically how to use it. Uh, on the back you mount uh, the NEB uh, connection. It's uh, four wires to the control system. And always remember to connect uh, 12 uh, volts of power supply to the control system. Otherwise you won't get any LEDs uh, blinking in, in this uh, unit.